I want to thank everybody that came out to support this event. But the main thing I want to do is thank the fighters. Because without the fighters going out there day in and day out, racking up victories, we wouldn't be here today for this explosive car. I commend James DeGal on his career. One hell of a job. Bottle Jack, very humble, very appreciative, very dedicated to his craft, awesome. The Sniper, unbelievable fighter, very crafty. Javante Tank Davis, power in both hands. So, Saturday, we're looking for another great night of boxing. I, I truly believe Saturday be, would be one of the best cards of this year, and this is the first, and this is the first fight of this year, championship boxing. We got so many newcomers, so many new faces um, that May, Mayweather Promotions has added to our promotion company. We, we just signed Delorme right there. Um, to my right, but to y'all left, I mean, we look forward to taking him to that next level and hopefully becoming world champion also. But everything takes time. Nothing happens overnight. Everything takes time. We started Mayweather Promotions to give back and help fighters. We wanted to, we wanted to change the game totally. It's about giving back helping fighters, not taking from fighters. How can a promoter know how a fighter feel if he's never been in a fighter shoes before or if he's never been in a fighter position before? I've been there, so I know how he feel. I know how he feel. I've been there before. I done fought in unification bouts. I done fought for my first world title. So I know what it takes. It takes a lot. But a lot of times what we do is talk about just the fighters. Let's talk about the team. The team has to stay up day in and day out. The team has to make sure these guys make weight. The team has to make sure these guys are on a curfew. So it takes a lot to build a card of this magnitude. It took a while for these two guys to come together. And one thing about me, I'm a man of my word. I'm a man of my word. When I first signed Javante Tank Davis, I told him, in under two years, you will be fighting for a world championship and you will be on TV. His first fight, pay-per-view. Five fights later, he's fighting for a world title. It's about producing. And what we do at Mayweather, Mayweather Promotions, we produce. We make things happen. You have to work with us, and everything takes time. Everything. Am I coming back? Absolutely not. I want to live through these fighters. It's not about the promoter getting the lion's share. It's about the fighters winning and growing and accomplishing their dreams. That's why we started Mayweather Promotions. I'm well off, but it's nothing like giving back to these fighters. That's the greatest feeling. Every night I go to bed, even when a fighter call my phone and say, you know what, Floyd? I have to work a nine to five. And you know what I tell them? Do what you have to do. I'm still gonna support you, but if you need my help, we're here. We're here, that's what it's about. I wanna commend Mayweather promotion staff for working so extremely hard day in and day out. I've never even been to the Mayweather promotions office, never. <laughs> But I know I got a great team, because if I didn't have a great team, we wouldn't be here today. Um, I know there's so many different sponsors that's 
covering this event. So let me turn back and look. Oh, <laughs> uh, we got Corona. Gotta say we got TMT. Gotta say that. Yeah. Wanna thank Barclays. But I also wanna thank the fans in the UK for supporting this man right here, James DeGale. Continue to stand behind him after January 14th. Because we don't know what could happen. That's why we're here, for the best to fight the best. Right now, my honest opinion, this, this is the best fighter in the UK. He's facing one of the best fighters in the world. Both of these guys are hell of a fighters. And I'm so proud of Badu Jack. The first time I seen Badu Jack in the gym, I seen him boxing. I said, who is he working with? I didn't care who he was working with. When a guy sacrificed taking a bus, fly, flying from overseas to come to the US to accomplish his dreams, taking a bus to the boxing gym, Every day, brought his, his girlfriend, because that was his girlfriend at that particular time. <coughs> she stood behind him. And we need more women like your wife in this world today. Walking to the gym with him every day. Taking a bus to the gym with him every day. Standing behind him, believing. And I told him with patience, we will make it happen. I don't know how long it took. I don't, I don't think it took that much time. But one thing about Badu Jack, he never cried, he never complained. Every time we put an opponent in front of him, he never said nothing. He's not like these fighters. Oh, I wanna fight him. Oh no, I wanna fight him. He just go out there, he just like Nike, he go out there and do it. Same for this guy right here. Now that's what we bring these two together. This card is gonna be a hell of a card. One hell of a card. And so I know people that's tuning in in social media, and for the people that's tuning in live, tune in Saturday for this unification bout. Tune in Saturday for this 130 pound bout. The one versus the sniper. This is one hell of a double header. But we cannot forget Showbox. Is it Showbox, Leonard? Showtime Extreme. I want to make sure it's, I'm right. I'm one of the sharpest knives in the drawer. Like I said before, you know, I may, I may make a mistake. We all, we all know God only made one thing perfect. It's my boxing record. Yeah! <laughs> I want to commend him. James DeGale team and say, you guys done one hell of a, one hell of a job. Lou DeBella, for so many years, I've been doing Lou DeBella 20, 21 years now. And when I first went to Lou, I told Lou, crazy story, I told Lou, oh, Lou, you know I'm gonna break all records in boxing. You know I'm gonna be the biggest fighter in boxing history. He probably looked at me like, huh? I said, yeah. I said, in due time. So every time I see, every time I watch a boxing match on TV, when it was on HBO, because that's when HBO was the A side, but it's no disrespect to HBO, you know? We willing to work with anybody. Every time I see a fighter fight, Even if he wasn't world champion and he looked good, I would go out there and run. I would go to the boxing gym and train. And that's what every guy up here has done. They're, they dedicated themselves to the sport of boxing to get to this plateau. To go out there and perform at the highest heights. 
There's still levels to grow for all these young fighters up here. There's still levels to grow. First you say, um, I want to get on TV. Then you say, I want to I want to move from TV to Showtime. Well, I want to move from TV to HBO. I want to move up. It's about levels moving up. But the ultimate goal is to become a pay-per-view star. And if you can't become a pay-per-view star, accomplish what you want to accomplish, what you feel comfortable with accomplishing. All the different social media outlets, I want to say thank you for supporting this event. Team DeBella, Team DeGal, Badu Jack, you part of my team, Javante Tank Davis, go out there and be the best that you can be Saturday night. Make with promotions with all fighters in boxing. You're going to go through ups and downs. But the main thing is we keep fighting. We keep working hard. That's what this is all about. I want to say thank you to the Barclays. Thank the whole city of Brooklyn. Thank the whole city of New York for just supporting us. Mayweather Promotions, we are the past, the present, and the future of sports and entertainment. And we are here to stay. So make room for us. I want to thank everybody for supporting this event. Tune in Saturday. Jack versus the gal, unification bout. And may the best men win. Thank you.